Have you ever wondered what a rider does from the warm-up to getting on the start ramp of a Grand Tour? Well, we are at the start of stage one of the Giro d'Italia in Appledorn, and it offers a really unique opportunity to find out because everything is so close together that we can follow the riders from their warm-up at the team buses right the way through the UCI's bike check to the top of the start ramp. First up, it's the warm-up. Each rider will have a uniquely tailored warm-up routine, as pictured just down there. So there'll be sections of just spinning the legs lightly, high-intensity sprints, and then riding at threshold to get them exactly where they need to be for the start of what is quite a short time trial. Each rider will know exactly what they're doing. So the bike will be laid up on the toe at 1425. He'll start his warm-up at 1455 finish at 15.25, so that's a half an hour warm up, and then he has 15 minutes to get from here to the start ramp. So the riders had the warm up, they've ridden to the start zone, and this is where the UCI then do their jobs. They'll be measuring the frame to make sure it fits within the UCI limitations. So in particular, they'll be looking at the reach, so the saddle to the end of the tri bars. Also, they'll be looking at the frame geometry themselves to make sure it's within tolerance. Otherwise, plain and simple, the bike gets turned away. After the bikes have been measured by the UCI officials, they then get checked for motors. So we can see a guy with an iPad using it as a scanner. This is how they caught Femke van Andriesche back at the Cyclocross World Championships. And they're checking every single bike for today's first stage of the Giro d'Italia. Riders will be in this holding area for five or ten minutes before their start time. Although it's a very warm day outside, one or two riders are taking the warm-up to the max, making sure their legs are as fresh as possible before the start. So once the riders have warmed up, they've had their bikes checked for measurements by the UCI. They've then had the bikes checked for motors. It's just a matter of getting themselves into the zone and a bit of quiet downtime. The riders have completed their warm up. They've had their bike measured and checked by the UCI. They've also had it checked for motors. Then they've got themselves into that all important zone. Now they're at the top of the start ramp and their journey on this year's Giro d'Italia is just beginning. It certainly is. Wow, that's Bram Tankink. Fantastic stuff. And for even more Giro d'Italia content, how about clicking just up here? And to check out the latest GCN show, click down there. And to subscribe to GCN, you know it makes sense, click on the globe. And don't forget to share and like this video too, eh, Tom? Exactly, exactly. <laughs>